I spelled it out. We were kind of blinded by the explosion. Just close your eyes. Oh my gosh, it's burned into our retinas! Come to Masami's birthday <laughs> party. Dude, this is bad. I know, I've seen it 20 times today. The doctor said it should fade sometime between now and the oh, next 10 years. Yeah, Have a nice day. <laughs> What's not to like? There'll be uh, cake and games what? and cake, cake. You don't get it, Mr. Dad. This is Masami. She's like the princess of Elmore Junior High. Everything's got to be perfect. You saw the invitation? Still can. And who knows what will happen if she's disappointed? Her dad's a very powerful man. Do you remember Harry from third grade? I remember so Harry. She used to sit behind me in math. Not your third grade, our third grade. I remember him. He gave Masami a pair of toe socks. Big biggest. mistake. Masami doesn't have legs. Next thing you know, Harry's dad lost his job at the Rainbow Factory, and the whole family moved out of town. Don't worry. That could never happen to us. I don't have a job. But Mrs. Mom does. We need to get Masami the best gift ever. But what do you get for the girl who has everything? Nothing! <laughs> uh, what about friendship? Isn't being there for someone the most beautiful gift you can give? Or we lie our way out of the party. Yep, much better plan. And that's when the raccoons broke into our house because they started that turf war with the skunks and while they were fighting, they fell into the shark tank and then one of the raccoons grabbed the invitees to try to get out but got eaten anyway and that's why we can't come to your party, okay, bye. Hold on a second. You can't come because you lost the invite that was burnt into your retinas? Yes. We'll just have another one. <laughs> See you at the party, I guess. Of course, now that we're double invited. <laughs> <sighs> Could you point us toward the classroom, please? Could you point me toward the exit? <laughs> <laughs>